Hey everyone, it's Melody. I am here with another decluttering video. Uh, if you guys have been watching my channel, you know that I've been trying to get rid of a bunch of stuff from my house, <laughs> a bunch of my belongings. This time we're gonna go ahead and try, try to tackle my CD collection. Like my DVD and Blu-ray decluttering video, um, I did note that, you know, DVDs and Blu-rays, um, while we still buy them because we have DVD and Blu-ray players, it's not like the most up-to-date form of watching movies because you can stream most of them. Um, and much, very similar to that, um, CDs. I only have one thing that actually plays CDs now and it's, it, it's my car. Like my car is the only thing that has a CD player in it. So I don't really have any other form of uh, method to play these. Um, so I'm gonna try to get rid of a bunch. So let's go ahead and get started. Um, my goal is to try to narrow this down to one tower, maybe even just half a tower. We shall see, okay? So what do we have up here first? We've got some, what is this? Empty. Oh, we've just got some, these are um, like movies and stuff. So I'm gonna keep these. Um, next shelf, we have a bunch of David Cook CDs because when This Loud Morning came out, I bought, I think, 20 copies of it. 2015? I don't even remember. So, let's see, which one is opened? This one's opened. Um, I won't keep all of them, obviously, so well, let's see. David Cook, This Quiet Night. I will go ahead and keep those. This is Oh, this is a David Archuleta CD where I lost, I forgot the CD in a car that I rented, so that has to go. This is David Cook's first CD, David Archuleta's Japanese CD, Ryan Starr CD, David Archuleta's second CD, David Archuleta's first CD, David, oh, this another This Quiet Night. Is this opened? This one is brand new, I will get rid of that. Another David Archuleta Japanese CD and a David Archuleta CD. So those can stay. I'm a pretty big fan of them. Oh, here, I found another David Archuleta CD. We'll put it with David Archuleta stuff. But why is there no case for it? Oh, that's gonna bother me. Let's move on to this next one. I've got Jason Mraz, plus one, plus one, plus one. O-Town, plus one. O-Town and plus one can stick together. O-Town, plus one can stick together, O-Town right there. Um, Boys to Men, oh my god, this was my very first CD ever, ever. Like, I was in, uh, gosh, I was in seventh grade, I think, sixth or seventh grade, and I bought this. I'm gonna keep that. Boys Own, Boys Own, Kelly Clarkson. Kelly Clarkson, do I need your CD? Breakaway is a good CD. But you know what, I can listen to you on Spotify, Kelly Clarkson. Uh, Boys Own 5, Britney Spears, eh? Britney Spears. I think I'm gonna get it ripped up of Britney Spears' CD. I mean, this CD was my childhood and everything, but not my childhood. I was in high school, but I felt like a kid. Do I need this? No, I don't. No, I don't. Uh, Billy Piper, Billy Piper, I'll keep those. And David Archuleta, I'll keep David Archuleta. All right, down here we've got more five. Five can go with five. I need to maybe just organize this. Maybe I should call this an organizational versus a decluttering, but I am going to try to declutter. We got Boy Zone up in here. I'm gonna keep these because um, they were imports. I bought them at like Virgin Records. Do you guys remember Virgin Records? Maybe you don't. Maybe y'all are young. Um, but I bought them from the import section and I love them. Okay, so. Coming down here, Josh Groban, Josh Groban, Bop Boys. Dang darn it, Bop Boys. Bop Boys, what's on you? You know, I'm gonna keep that because it has a Kavana song that I love, and I have no idea if Kavana is on Spotify. The Chicago soundtrack I could get rid of. What is this? Cinderella. Oh, Roger and it's Hamish son. I'm gonna keep that. John Mayer. I don't need John Mayer CD. Uh, another John Mayer CD that is brand new. John Mayer, lots of John Mayer CDs. In sync. In sync and Alanis Morissette. Dang darn. You know, I'm gonna get rid of. Oh man, I'm gonna get rid of Alanis. Am I gonna get rid of In Sync? Yeah, In Sync is on Spotify, isn't it? Okay, I'm gonna get rid of In Sync. All American Rejects. Oh, I loved 
this album. They don't need it though. I'm gonna get rid of that. Um, what is this? Frankie Perez. I'm gonna get rid of that. Um, Girls Aloud, my favorites. I'm gonna keep you. Robin, oh shoot, Robin had a good CD. I was so into British pop music and just like European pop music as a teen. Is, is Robin on Spotify? I'm gonna double check to see if Robin's on Spotify before I get rid of that. Jason Mraz, I will keep. I mean, I have favorite artists and so those things I will keep because I obviously collect them. Um, Backstreet Boys is one of them. Backstreet Boys, I will keep you forever. Oh, Kelly Clarkson, this I never even opened. Look at that, that's so sad. Which one is this again? Oh, this is the album I didn't even like that much, even though I know she loved it. I'm gonna get rid of that. Kelly Clarkson, oh my, I, I, the first season of American Idol was amazing and I went to the Idol concert show that they had here in Las Vegas. Um, I loved it. Sounds of the season. Damn it, I love Christmas music, I'm gonna keep that. Nick Carter's album, I will keep that because you a Backstreet Boy. This Hairspray album was so good. I loved it, but I can listen to that elsewhere. Oh, I have the High School Musical 2 soundtrack. I'm gonna get rid of that. American, oh my gosh, you know what? I watched this too, you guys. They did one season of America Juniors, and they had they, they recorded songs from um, S Club 8 and stuff, or like S Club 7, 8? Eight? 8, I think. And I'm like, that's my jam, I wanna keep that. Aaron Carter, no, I'm not gonna keep that. Um, oh, Delta Goodwin. Delta, I love you, I'm gonna keep that. I think this is maybe where we're gonna run into some trouble, because I know I have a lot of Westlife CDs and I'm gonna keep all of them. Westlife, 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 Westlife. Westlife, Westlife. Do I have two of these Westlife albums? Why do I have two World of Your Own? Is one American? This one has 17 songs. This one has 17 songs, what the heck? Maybe one of them is empty. I will check the insides of that. I don't know why it's like that. Westlife, Westlife, Steps, A1, 911. Did I like 911? I don't think I like this album. I'm gonna get rid of that one. All Saints, I love that album. Oh wait, I have the Kavana album here. Wait a minute, bop boys. Let me look at you again. Oh, I said Ant and Deck though. I like that Ant and Deck song. I have no idea if they are on Spotify. Bewitched. Oh, Bewitched, are you on Spotify? I'm gonna check Bewitched and Robin, see if those were on Spotify. Um. Oh my gosh, love BB Mac. I'm gonna keep BB Mac. I love BB Mac. What is this? Oh, this is just like a bunch of pictures or something. Wow, I found a CD of pictures. The Ataris. Oh my gosh, you guys. One of my all-time favorite albums is this Atari's album. I absolutely love this album. Oh my gosh. So long a story. Oh my goodness, I'm gonna keep that. American Idol Greatest Moments, I don't need that. Atomic Kitten, I mean, I do love me some Atomic Kitten. Josh Groban, can go with Josh Groban. I thought somewhere up there. Miss Joy Williams, this album was so good, Miss Joy Williams, but your new stuff is great too, but I loved this album. I don't even care to keep that. Do you guys know, have you ever watched A Mighty Wind, the musical? I mean, the movie. Great, great movie. Love it. I actually love this soundtrack. Is it on Spotify? I'm gonna check if that's on Spotify. If it is, then I'm gonna get rid of it. Josh Groban. Uh, Kelly Clarkson. Kelly Clarkson. Oh, this is your first album, ain't it? Yeah, I'm gonna get rid of that. Sorry, Kelly, I love you, but I'm gonna get rid of it. Dave Chaletta, oh goodness. Ella, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Is Ella on Spotify? This is my, this is my question of the day. Is, uh, is blank on Spotify? Boyzone, I gotta keep Boyzone. Westlife goes with Westlife, hello. I have a bunch of Westlife albums because they're my actual favorite. Okay, now we're running to the Korean stuff. I'm gonna go ahead and donate that one to my parents. Donate this one to my parents. Oh man, the second Yoo Sung Joon album. Oh man, you 
you guys don't even know him. <laughs> this is like, oh man. I don't think he's on Spotify, is he? I'm gonna check. If he's on Spotify, we'll, we'll get rid of it, okay? I promise. I love me some Rebecca St. James. She has gotta be on Spotify though. Yeah, I think she's probably on Spotify. I'll get rid of that. Oh my gosh, Kai. And then Kai actually, I met them and they signed this for me. I'll be keeping that, thank you very much. Um, Jeff LeBlanc, oh, I he was an opener for David Archuleta. He signed this for me, but I think I'm gonna let it go. I'm okay with that. Stuck in the sur Suburbs was a Disney movie um, and I actually loved it because of the music. I'm gonna keep that. <laughs> Backstreet Boys. Switchfoot, I'm gonna get rid of Switchfoot. Take that, I love me some Take That. Do I need this Toby Mac album? I know I used to love it. Toby Mac, I'm gonna get rid of Toby Mac. I think I'm gonna get rid of, oh man, I used to, I still do, but I used to love contemporary Christian music. Oh, you know what, I'm gonna keep both of these WOW albums. So this was 2001, 2002, and that's when I was really into it. So I think those, that's gonna just be like a little um, scrapbook for myself. Is Zoe Girl on Spotify? I doubt they can be on Spotify. I used to love this album. I am gonna double check. I have a pile of albums I have to check to see if they're on Spotify. This is a Backstreet Boy album. Some sort of special. Okay, Backstreet Boys. Do you guys have these Backstreet Boy CDs, the Shape CDs? You know what, I wanna get rid of these Shape CDs. It's like the shape of their face. I have Nick and Brian's. I'm gonna get rid of those. Cause I don't even think my seat, my car will play them. I don't have anything to play them. <gasps> I love the Benton Paul album and I met Benton Paul and he signed it for me. I'll keep that. But I don't know if Benton Paul is on Spotify. This plus one. Christmas albums are my jam. I will more than likely be keeping all Christmas albums. Oh my gosh. Rain. I'm gonna keep all my Rain CDs. I love Rain. What is this? The <laughs> Little Mermaid soundtrack. I know this is on Spotify, so I'm gonna get rid of it. That's such a good one, though. You guys watch, listen to the original Broadway cast of The Little Mermaid for sure. <gasps> soul Decision. Is Soul Decision on Spotify? I will check. I will check to see if Soul Decision is on Spotify. The Spice Girls have to be on Spotify. I'm gonna get rid of both of my Spice Girl albums because I'm sure they're on Spotify. Stacy Arico, are you on Spotify, girl? Because I loved both of your albums. Oh, this is Rachel Lampa. I am going to check to see if Rachel Lampa and Stacy Arico are on Spotify. I will check on those. David Archuleta. David Archuleta. This is a Kanjani 8. I've never even opened it, but I loved this song. This is a single. I used to collect a lot of Japanese CDs. I mean, I've sold like 98, 99% of my collection, but I love this one. Uh, I'm gonna keep that. Oh gosh, I hope it's bright enough. I know it's kind of getting darker down here because the lighting is not great. Ace of Base, I know Ace of Base on Spotify. I'll get rid of that. Oh, the second Stacy Arico, I'll check that. Stacy, oi, Stacy, are you on Spotify, girl? Backstreet Boys, Backstreet Boys. No, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, Steven. Steven, oh bless you, Steven, we miss you. This album was so good, Steven, too. Steven, are you on Spotify? Steven, I think I'm gonna keep you with Poison. I just love you so much. All right, Westlife, Westlife. Another Shape CD, Howie, I'm sorry, Howie. Those just won't play on anything I own. What is this for the fans? I want it that way live. You know what, I don't even know if the these special B-side stuff is on Spotify, so I'll keep all that. Keep that. Backstreet Boys. What is this? Fat Chance is definitely not gonna be on Spotify. I'm gonna keep that, just in case I ever wanna listen to it again. Um, Backstreet Boys, Backstreet Boys. Look at all of these singles that I had to purchase as a Backstreet Boys fan because these were all from Europe because they were so much bigger in Europe than they were here for the longest time. I am, I love Backstreet Boys. The Romeo and Juliet soundtrack is literally one of the best. I'm gonna get rid of it because I know that has to be on Spotify. S Club 8, I'm gonna, wait, is S Club 8? No, I'm gonna keep that because I love them. Oh my gosh, I miss them. 
BB Mac can go with BB Mac. I know I had another BB Mac one somewhere. I'll check. Oh no, this is too good, Josh Groban. Chess in concert. I'm. Any, I know Josh Groban and Chess and stuff like that are gonna be on Spotify, but I gotta keep that. So Big Bang, K-pop, K-pop, oh, Korean pop, K-pop. G.O.D. used to be my number one favorite K-pop group. I loved G.O.D. so much. Oh my gosh, they used to be everything. Oh, the Legally Blonde soundtrack, which is so good. I'm going to get rid of that. I, it's not even open, but I know that has to be on um, Spotify. Oh, these are so good too. MWK. Yeah, I want to keep that. I don't know if that, you know. I'll check. Uh, you know, no. Okay, Bravo All Stars. Let the music heal your soul. I remember now. I remember. This has to be on Spotify, right? It's just one song. I mean, literally, the song has to be somewhere on the internet. Yeah, I'm gonna get rid of that then. Plus one, I'll keep with my plus one so stuff. Oh, Rachel Lampa, I'll keep it. Wait, Rachel Lampa. Oh yeah, we were gonna check. We were gonna check to see if Rachel Lampa was there. The Lord of the Rings. I'm gonna have to get rid of that soundtrack. I love it, but no thank you, Rachel Lampa. We're checking on you, girl. MWK can go with MWK stuff. Gavin DeGraw, I have a bunch of Gavin DeGraw songs because I <laughs> I met him like so many times and I kept buying his CDs because I just kept meeting him, so. Um, oh my gosh, this is a Dong Bang uh, DBSK. Is this a good one? Yeah, I like that one a lot because there's a song on there that I love. Oh my gosh, I love this song from DBSK. No wonder, I, these are the two that I kept because I love them, I remember now. So I'm gonna keep this there. This Rachel Lampa. Man, Rachel Lampa, are you on Spotify? I just gotta check. Rachel girl, I will check. Okay, back up here. We don't have too much too many left. I have to go through all of these because I think these are just mixed CDs. So I will see if I want to get rid of any of those. Um, okay, so Backstreet Boys, Backstreet Boys, Backstreet Boys. What are these? Backstreet Boys with no case. Backstreet Boys with no case. These all have to be. Backstreet Boys, Backstreet Boys. Wait, wait, oh my, no! LFO. Five. Soul Decision. Wait a minute, are these just all singles? Let me bring these out. This is just a random mix of songs. Yeah, I don't even know what that is. I'll get rid of that. Westlife, I will keep because I love Westlife. <gasps> Do you guys remember them, Innocence? They, are they, is this song on Spotify? Because I love that song. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna wait on that. This is just a random thing. Tower Records, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, you guys. You can already tell right now. Oh my gosh, one voice when you think about me. Is that on Spotify? Oh gosh, I have to check Spotify. Steps, One for Sorrow. Do I have, wait, is One for Sorrow on? Oh, it has the US mix. Steps, are you on Spotify? I wanna check. Summer Girls is on that LFO album I kept, I think, right? Summer Girls is gonna be on Spotify. I'm gonna get rid of that. Five, When the Lights Go Out, that's gotta be on Spotify. Soul Decision, Faded Radio Version, that's, got, that's on Spotify. Soul Decision, Soul Decision's Faded has to be on Spotify. And then Britney Spears, Baby One More Time with Autumn Goodbye, that has to be on Spotify, right? Those should be. All right, and then, just a few more here. So um, there's a Kanjani 8 one, this Wonder Girls album. I'm gonna keep that Wonder Girls album. Oh my gosh, I have a Tokyo album, but I, so see how small this is going to be, this CD? Crap, I'm gonna try to sell this one though. I'll try to say, sell that on eBay. Cause I, don't, I won't be able to play it on anything. It's so dang darn small. Oh, I love Chong Wook. I'm gonna keep that one. Another G.O.D. album. I hate these that are all wonky shaped. I'm so mad at all of these people who made wonky shaped CDs. Give our Chilettas forevermore. Oh my gosh. I guess I wanted to keep that. Give our Chiletta, why would you make a wonky shaped CD? Oh, the other side of down Asian tour version. The heck? I don't even remember some of this stuff. Okay, I have two of them for some reason as well. Are they different? I will look to see if those are different. I'll get rid of one of them. Korean, David Archuleta. 
Jason Mraz, Jeff LeBlanc. Oh my gosh, Jeff, I'm sorry, don't watch this YouTube video. Okay. Okay, let me organize and then get back to you guys. <laughs> All right, so everything is organized finally. Oh my goodness gracious. So um, I have most of these by artists or genre-esque kind of um, organized most of it onto one tower. Um, you can see that the white tower, the one on the left, does have a few um, things right there on the bottom shelves. Uh, those are actually some DVDs that I need to go through and put elsewhere. I'm just gonna stick them there for now. But this is the big old pile of stuff we're gonna go ahead and donate. I've decided just to go ahead and donate this Tokyo CD even though I am like 1000% sure people are gonna be like, what is this? Um, but yeah, this is everything. So I'm pretty stoked. I looked up everything, all the artists where I was like, are they on Spotify? I looked up every single one of them. So some of them I did keep and some of them I uh, let go of if they were on Spotify. Yeah, so if they were not on Spotify, I kept those albums. So I'm actually pretty stoked to find so many of the artists on Spotify. <laughs> That's actually a pretty cool thing. Um, and then I actually went through the uh, rack again just one more time to make sure that I didn't miss out on anything. So I did take out a few more than what I showed um, when I was kind of trying to go through. I kind of did that in a hot mess like I usually do for these sort of things. Um, but hopefully it was in focus for the most part. <laughs> Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you guys wanna see more of my decluttering videos, definitely check out the links um, in the description box below. I'll try to make a playlist for them since I have so many now. Um, if you guys wanna see more from me, hit subscribe, like, comment with any of these CDs that maybe you were like, oh, I used to have that CD. You know what I mean? I'm sure we all have those. Um, thank you again for watching. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.